Hello, I'm going to show you one of the new features in um, C4, and that's called Satin Rays. This is a type of outline. Um, so I'm just going to do a easy little stitch here. Um, and it does it, oh, I didn't make it large enough. Hold on. There. <laughs> So now um, we've got it like we want it. Instead of that, we don't want it a run stitch. We want it a satin stitch. So I'm going to go over to my outline stitch type and choose the satin. And it will make it the nice satin. But you can change the width of it. Okay. Now, what I want to show you is. If you zoom in on this, you'll see it's just stitching. I have no underlay under it or anything. So it's just stitching the satin column. Now I'm going to change this to the satin raised, which is right next to it. And all I have to do is click on it. And now I want you to look. I'm going to zoom in on this so you can see this. Here is one very narrow column, and then it puts another one a little bit wider, and then it puts another one a little bit wider than that, and then it does the satin cover. Now, in true view, you can't see any difference. I do want to show you in the color object list. Um, I'm going to duplicate this, bring it up here, okay, and change this one back to the satin. So the satin has 700 stitches in it, and the ray, satin raised is 2410. So it does add a considerable amount of stitches to your design, but if you want the look, of raised so it makes it look like it's got foam underneath it or you just want it to stand out this is a very easy way to do it and it is the satin run or sorry satin raised run 